Um, it's Farmer Girl Jesse coming here live from my farm with Pro Jamaica. As, as you can see, we're here out. The sun is out already. It's about 10 o'clock now. And we're going to take a quick stroll and preview of my farm. So come on, let's see what's going on. All right. Cool. So here yeah, I'm at in the putty. So you call these are freshly planted putty. Right. These are I plant these like um, two weeks ago. Mm -hmm. so, you know, like three months and a half from now, harvesting time, the best time of farming. Okay. But for now, we're here doing some work. About a week from now, I'm going to fertilize these and I think get them cleaned out and stuff like that. Okay, good, good, good. Yes, yeah, so today I'm on the farm in St. Elizabeth and guys, I'm enjoying this. And this young lady has been an inspiration to all of us. Because she has motivated me to you to say, oh, Chevy, you need to take up back your farming. So here we are on the farm, and she's just showing us and hoping no, you guys. We're going to my pumpkin farm. All right, cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. So hopefully you. Right? Oh, man, my, my skill, my skill, a country we come from, too. Okay. <laughs> we're on the pier there. Yeah, Them not ready yet. Definitely. I'm here for my right? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I'm going to have a visit back to your place. So these are the avocado beefs. These are not ready as yet. So, as you see, yeah. Alright. So, this is the pumpkin, right? Yes, yeah, this is my pumpkin farm. I took some the other day so you won't see much of them, but I have some smaller ones here that you can, you know? Okay, cool, cool. But, at the end of um, next month, they will be lovely, lovely okay. red pumpkins. Okay, cool. I planted some the other day in my, in my backyard, you know. Hopefully they come. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, you just plant them and leave, you fertilize yeah, them and things? I have to fertilize them. Okay, okay, cool, yeah. cool. When they just, you plant them like a, three weeks after you can fertilize them, or maybe two, depends on how early you want to do that. Okay. You don't want to give them too much either. All right, cool, cool, cool. Here I have some um, cocoa. Many Jamaicans don't know about cocoa, many young folks. But this is some cocoa and mixed with dasheen. Mm -hmm. And here is another lovely, lovely baby. I don't think this one is, no, I don't think I'm going to I want to pick one, but I want to find a really good one. But growing up, they told me if I touch the pumpkin. What will happen? It's like a spoil. No. That's a myth? No, nothing like that. Okay. You know, some people they farm the whole away. There are things that we can learn. Uh -huh. If you said something, you can try it and see if it works. Okay. If you touch the pumpkin, nothing won't happen to it. Okay. Nothing will happen. Well, you can play with the pumpkin. Oh, oh cool, cool. You can play with the plant. Any plant at all. Yeah. You cannot play with it too much. Yeah. Right. No, where's the machine? I need to knock it out to see how it looks. No, I did not get it out. I wanted you to see the inside, but okay, okay. So this is this is fit and this. Yes, this is ready. All right. You have yourself a nice pumpkin. All right, good. I good. hope so. Good. Now we are going to sweet potato farm. All right. So guys, this is lovely. I love this. I love the experience. Now I always want to do this and. Here we are now, in the farm, on the farm. So this is pumpkin, yeah. Oh, I don't think so. It's all right if I can't find any. I'm good with the, cause I really love my pumpkin. You love pumpkin? Bad, bad, so oh. that one pumpkin there. This is my favorite though. Yeah, well, guess favorite. what we started that with? I started to crush it with the Water? ripe planting. Bad. Just bad, bad, bad. This is the other day I, I started this, you know. Oh. I mean, I tell you, say, yo, nice. Here we are. You see when the pumpkin runs all over? Mm -hmm. it, it was planted over there. And it, oh, yeah, yeah. You have pumpkin, you have pumpkin all the way to here. Oh, and they want to nice. Yeah, but they are still not full. Still not you can ready. see the shininess on it? Yes. It has way bigger to go. But hopefully, mind them in you know, my yard. Yeah. Grosser. Did you fertilize them? No, I just planted them the other day and they come up. How much of them did you plant? About five different, six different holes. I buy the little pack in the in the supermarket. Oh, I could give you some seed if you own oh my god. I know. But definitely I'll go visit the farmer next time. Okay. 
So, you know the thing. Go. This is a younger piece of, this is a younger piece of pumpkin. Uh -huh. You see that big that one is? Yeah, yeah. And it's very young. It has a way, way more to go. Okay. I have a water catchment and this is the best part. Are oh, well, you putting the for fish them here? Or? No. Let's see, look at insects. Like there's always insects. Oh, me thinks there's some something you put in. So you don't put fish in there and everything no, there. No. What oh. is gonna be raw? Oh, oh, oh. So this is easy for you then, since you have a little catchment. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Uh -huh. If I plant the cabbage over there, a cabbage took a lot of spray. I just spray like every week. Oh. It takes a lot of water. Yeah. When there's no rain, it's kind of hectic. I cannot waste the water or anything like that. Yeah. So what's the most difficult? Yeah. So in terms of farming, what is the most difficult time for you? Is difficult time is drought. Drought. Which um there is lack of rain. You know the plant needs water. If you, if, if you even have spraying to do, mm -hmm. you don't have water on your farm. That's another setback alongside with the drought. Okay. So if you're if you're not getting water and you can spray them, mm -hmm. you know whenever you can or when they want spray, that would be good for them. Okay. So the worst time is drought. Okay. Yeah. Good. But when we're getting rainfall here, uh -huh. you get a lot. It's extremely nice. Okay. Here I have some sweet peppers. Uh -huh. I'm getting them clean as you can see here in some bush. I'm getting them clean up by now and next week. So I should give them some spray and send them off. They're already blossoming. Uh, I realize. I realize. I see. I see some blossom on them. This All right. And this one. Mm -hmm. There's a blossom. All right. So there's gonna be a lot on this one. In terms of cleaning this good plot of land, does it take a lot of money? And it, how do you manage? Um, Would you need help? Yeah. For, because to be honest, I'm a single mom. I know how that part goes. Yeah. And I'm a full-time farmer. I just As you can see, it is in a devastating condition, uh -huh. and I cannot step to it right now because I'm kind of backward now okay. funds Influential. financially right now. And you'd want to clean up all of this? And yes, I would love to. Okay. So I don't know if I could get just a little push. I would be so grateful at this point for just that. All you know, right. to push forward whatever I'm doing because I have the ability and I have the mindset, the strength, and everything, but. Financially, I'm kind of staggered down that path. All right, I'll definitely. Yeah. I know that persons will be willing to support the movement, and we'll... my cabbage farm. All right, so we're gonna put this into the cabbage farm now, peeps. I'm just yes. making sure I don't step on any of the pepper. Yes. Now, this is the cabbage farm. Yeah. This is the cabbage farm. Yeah. 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 Because these are some younger cabbages. Uh -huh. These are not yet ready. As you can see, these are the foundations of the cabbage. Okay. They start off like this. Uh -huh. They fold up, get hard. Yeah. You got your vegetable ready. All right. And, and this cabbage, cabbage is a plant that takes a lot. It is very expensive to produce cabbages. Okay. So you, you have to spray it. Yeah, spray you it a lot. Allow them to bite it because the worms love cabbage. Yeah, yeah. Insects love cabbage. You have to and these are them. pretty though. You have to keep them clean from the worms. Okay. These are the younger ones, as I said. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So now we are. But it's not quite ready. It has more potential to get um harder. Okay. The harder it is, it's better for the farmer. All right, good. It weighs more. Yeah. yeah. I set you a beautiful one. This one. All right. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. The knife would be better to cut it, but here. Perfect. Beautiful. Yeah, from Jesse's farm <laughs> to your pot. <laughs> All right. The 
because I love to give people what is best. Uh -huh. And I sprayed it. Okay. It's 48 hours for the chemical to so, come off the pan. Okay, okay, because cool. I did not get any rain. I uh -huh. did not rain and the rain fall yesterday. Okay. Okay. I showers yesterday. Okay. So I'm going to cut. This is another nice one. <laughs> All right. The one? Yeah, bitch. 48 hours it takes for the chemical to wear off the plant. Okay. But it's better to reap it whenever you get some rain. Okay. So you can give people, you know, something fresh. Fresh, fresh. And I'm yeah. all about that. Yeah. yeah. So we're here on Jesse's farm. Yeah. So please, guys, just remember to follow her on Instagram. And me know she can build our YouTube channel peeps. So make sure when she ready you know, subscribe to it and follow our journey. You guys will enjoy. Understand? Yep. Oh, so you just you just um, mix the cups and per season. I didn't take that in there. Yeah? Nothing can plant on it. But if you plant it beside, it can actually grow. And then like cucumber and pumpkin, so cucumber and pumpkin and learning about farming. Yeah, you man. can do farming, definitely you can. <laughs> I'll pass you. I'll give you a pass. Alright. Something right. about it. <laughs> yeah. Whew. You could take a pause and rest so I can pick up cucumber. Alright. It's alright with the cucumbers in a cause. You don't have to pick much of that. I'm good. I'm just glad that I'm here okay. and I was able to capture so to as much as thing there. Because okay. guess what? You see with the cook? These are some okra. Alright. So these the are the okra. Hard. Good for strong up back. Yes. And then thing there. So how long the okra takes to, to come? Come in, I want to plant some of that too, you know. Oh my god, I, I don't really time my plant. I that's a problem with me. I don't Time them. Okay, so okay. No you just plant your thing, them, and just. Yeah, if I have a little upper seed, uh -huh. I know I'm going to want it to eat, or to sow it, what, wherever I plant something. Okay. Yeah. You can see they're getting old. Uh -huh, I don't so have time to pick them. I'm so busy every day. Okay. Work. Work. These are good, right? These are. Yeah, man. That that good one. To once we put them down, and I think. Here I have my little skeleton. Oh. Plant things to grow in my pot. Yeah. Yeah. So this is scary. Okay, yeah. mm -hmm. And these are peas? Yeah, red peas. Okay. You can't have little tape. Sorry, please look. Yeah, those are kind of fungus. Okay, that's how them, them look so. Okay, okay. For, oh. for the worms. And these, this one also, also for cabbage. This one for 2,000 something. This is for almost 3,000. So you see, the, it costs so much. And if you don't have these, it can stagger your farm way downhill. Yeah. You can push your way back. So okay. when the reaping time comes, you're going to be behind in quality and in amount. So if you don't have all of these, your fertilizer, your chemical, and a workman money, it's nothing. Problem. It's nothing. Yeah. yeah. All right.